Hello everyone, welcome back to Tactics. So, since uh, latest Nothing OS version 2.5.1 based on Android 14 is released on Nothing Phone 2, many of you were struggling to install the OS on your phone. So, in this video, I'm going to show you how to manually install or update Nothing OS 2.5.1 even if you are on 2.0.4. This video is for both rooted and non rooted users. So, first, I will tell you how to update for non root users, and after that, I will tell you how to update if you are rooted and custom recovery installed. So, as you can see here, that I'm using Nothing OS version 2.0.4 based on Android 13, uh, which was stable as well, but it is outdated now. And when I'm checking for updates, there are no updates. Uh, as you can see, you can also check on your phone. You will get no updates because nothing actually paused the updates. Because when they released this uh, for quite some time, people gave a feedback that uh, Google Dialer is not working. They are not able to make calls on Google Dialer. Some permission issue is there. But uh, no such issue I found when I installed this. Coming back to installation tutorial guys, first you have to download this full package of nothing was 2.5.1. The links for all required files are given in description and all of the files are provided by Spike and uh, Telegram community of nothing phone 2. So quickly join the nothing phone 2 Telegram community because that is the first thing you should do after purchasing nothing phone 2. And special thanks to Spike for all of the files. Now guys for non-rooted users what you have to do is you have to download the file put it in your internal storage then go to google dialer dial this number star hash star hash 682 hash star hash star you will get something like this a ui like this and uh, you need to browse the files and browse the ota update package which you have downloaded it will be around 2.7 gb now you have to select this file or what you can do is that uh, you can manually create a new folder in your internal storage let me show how you have to do that so go to file explorer and then in internal storage create a new folder called OTA in small letters no capitals OTA and after creating this folder what you have to do is you have to uh, go for the file which you have downloaded and copy or move this file into the new folder that we have created OTA folder and paste it here after doing this you have to go back to the google dialer dial the same number star hash star hash 682 hash star hash star now you will get uh, this window again you have to reload and you will get your file here because we have pasted in the same folder now click on this button and then click on ok now our new update is started installing so we just have to wait here patiently and it could take around 10 to 15 minutes so just wait patiently here after around 10 minutes you will get a pop up like this that means installation is successful now click on this button to reboot your device and guys that was it for non rooted user it is this simple to install the update now just wait for your phone to get booted and once it is booted you will see that it is version 2.5.1 stable and not 14 i'll fast forward the video now this part is for the rooted users who want to retain the root access after the update. So guys first of all let me show you that I am using the latest Mudisk here. So whenever we install an update, OTA update when root is installed then root will be lost after the phone is booted on the new OS. But we will retain that and I am also using a custom recovery orange fox recovery here. So first of all what I have to do here is that I have to install the stock recovery of my current android version. So I am using 2.0.4 currently and I will install the stock recovery of uh, nothing OS 2.0.4 you will get the download file in description again just uh, go and download and again special thanks to spike and nothing phone to telegram group for that now let me show you that this is orange fox recovery and we have to install the stock recovery once we are into orange fox recovery you can see i have renamed recovery.img of stock roam to this file because i don't want to get confused just click on it click on recovery click on flash to both slots and just simply slide the slider to flash the recovery in both slots i have installed the recovery now i can reboot to system once your phone is booted, we have to uninstall the Majisk temporarily as well. So what you have to do is we have to go to Majisk and just simply click on this button which is called uninstall Majisk. And do not complete uninstall, just click on this restore images. Once you click on restore images, you will get a pop-up like this. Images are restored. Once you get this pop-up, what we can do is that we can now install the OT update package using the same star hash star hash 682 hash star hash star offline updater method. Just simply uh, install it like we installed installed it in the non-rooted phones right just click on this button and wait for around 10 minutes so it will be installed and after 10 minutes when the update is installed do not click on confirm button just go back to my disk first and we have to do something here okay you know previously when we restored images it won't work until the device is rebooted that means our phone is still rooted and we can still flash uh, zip files from here so we will flash orange fox recovery first okay so this is orange fox recovery zip downloaded from the description link is given it will be flashed to both slots a and b just wait for the installation to complete 
and once the installation is completed guys we will restore the majesk as well because we have uh, you know clicked on restore images once we reboot majesk will be gone but we do not want to do that so we will install the majesk again so click on this install button and then click on direct install click on let's go your majesk will be installed once again on the current slot and after that we have to install it on the other slot as well so please wait for this do not reboot here again go back then click on install again click on install in the other slot then click on ok and then click on let's go we have to wait here again so once it is installed that will be the final thing that we have to do so just wait for the installation and done now guys we can uh, simply reboot the device here because we have installed majisk on our newly installed os as well right you can currently see it is still 2.0.4 and now we are going to update uh, by rebooting the device so just go back to OTA and reboot or you can simply reboot from anywhere now once your device is booted you will see that latest OS version 2.5.1 is installed and we will check it by verifying the QS panel style. Yes, it is square. That means we have successfully installed version 2.5.1. We will go to about phone section and you can see here it is written 2.5.1 nothing OS. So guys, successfully we have installed a nothing OS 2.5.1. Now we will check if Majisk is still there or not, if root access is still there or not. So Majisk is there and you can see that it is installed. So we have successfully retained Majisk and updated from 2.0.4 to 2.5.1 without losing data as well. So that was the simple and quick guide guys. I hope you liked the video and again special thanks to nothing phone 2 group on telegram and spike for the files given in description and please uh, guys subscribe to the channel of nothing phone 2 and also join the nothing phone 2 group on telegram for any update in future and now if this video has been helpful to you then please subscribe to tactics and uh, join the telegram tactics uh, drive channel